Welcome back to the DL Community Calendar. And Carrie, let's talk about uh, at least one of your events to start with, Ignite Your Edge, presented by the Detroit Lakes Regional Chamber of Commerce. What is it? When is it? And, and why do we need to know about it? Yeah, this is something brand new for the Chamber of Commerce. We are doing a women's speaker series. It's going to kick off March 4th with uh, Rebecca Undum. She's coming to the Holiday Inn from 3 until 5 o'clock and going to be talking about um, living your big dream. Don't let Detroit Lakes or your zip code hold you back. You still can live your big dream no matter where you live. And then she's kicking that off, of course, March 4th, but we have three other speakers throughout the year and we're really excited to bring a full women's speaker series to Detroit Lakes. So let me ask you this. It is a, a women's speaker series. Does that mean that you're only looking for women in the audience or can, can women and men come to listen to the women sure. speak? Well, of course, everyone is welcome. Um, but some of the topics are going to be geared more towards women, um, really talking about how do you balance life, whether you have children or not, what stage in life you are. But, um, you know, women and, and people in general have different needs and how they like to socialize and network. And uh, we hope that we can address those issues. Is there a cost to this event for the series at all? It is. Um, you get all four tickets for four different speakers throughout the year for $99. So it's pretty uh, affordable to be able to come. And then you can share those tickets. So if you can't make them tall, you can share them and, and give them to a friend and make sure that they get a chance to hear a speaker. I'm thinking also, Carrie, that this might be a good opportunity for um, businesses to get on board and send some of their, their employees to a series like this. Yeah, we hope that this is a great way for co-workers to get together. We did set the time from 3 until 5 each time so that it was during the workday on purpose because then you can still be punched in and an opportunity to get some um, not only personal growth but some uh, uh, good information to bring back to your co-workers and share an experience with co-workers. Got to like that. You can get out of work a little bit early and uh, listen to some of these speakers. So if you're looking for more information or you want to pick up tickets, where do you do that? Uh, you can check the Chamber website or, of course, stop into our office. We're really easy to find on Summit Avenue, but visit DetroitLakes.com has tons of information and we'll get you signed up. And I suspect if this goes well, you're hoping to make this kind of a, a, a year-long, never-ending series. Exactly. We hope year after year we'll have different topics and different speakers, but yes, we hope to continue to grow this. Great. Looks like a great event. We'll be back with more great events on the DL Community Calendar. Welcome back to the DL Community Calendar and Carrie with the Detroit Lakes Regional Chamber of Commerce. You've got uh, a great event coming up on March 27th. That's a Friday, the 2020 Economic Development Summit. Tell me a little bit about it. Yeah, we're excited to bring this. We've had this for well over 10 years. We've had an Economic Development Summit. Our goal is to tell the economic story of Detroit Lakes and the Detroit Lakes full region. Um, what are things happening? Is it something that's growing, a new business, road construction, all those kinds of things that affect businesses and organizations locally? And then this year, we're bringing in a keynote speaker. We have Ryan Pesch from the University of Minnesota Extension coming. He's going to be talking about workforce. Um, we know workforce is a big topic and a big need of employers and making sure how as a region and a community can we be addressing the workforce issues. Yeah, and you look at uh, workforce in the Lakes area uh, in particular, it seems like everybody is hiring and retention becomes a big deal, doesn't it? It is, and we have a lot of retirements. It's just uh, the demographics of our area, and when you start to look at the forecast for about five years from now, there's going to be even more retirements. So we need to make sure that we're attracting and retaining our employees and uh, making sure that they're fully trained and ready to stay here in the Lakes and continue to grow. So what's the best way to find out more information about this event and then to uh, pick up tickets? Of course, you can stop into the Chamber of Commerce office. We're at 700 Summit Avenue. Give us a call or uh, check out our website, visitdetroitlakes.com. We've got information. We'd love to see you March 27th. And it looks like there's some opportunities to sponsor the event as well. Yes, we're always looking for sponsor. Um, we can't do it without uh, people to, uh, sponsoring our events. And we uh, have an opportunity for our sponsors for this event to have a table and uh, send out some information. So a great audience and a great group of people. We get about 150 people in attendance. And it's usually a good variety of people interested in economic development. Curious uh, about the speaker. Where do you find the speakers and, and what motivates you to pick particular speakers each year? Well, we really try to know what's really the key issues for the region. What is important to Detroit Lakes and workforce, of course, this year is something um, that we knew was important. So we looked around the state. Who are our experts? Who's doing research? Who's got great numbers and information to bring to our community? And happens to be Ryan Pesch in our own back door. Um, he lives right here in the area. He's been doing a lot of research and work with his cohort. So we're excited for him to share his message. Yeah, it'll be fun to have him. That is Friday, March 27th, the 2020 Economic Development Summit uh, put on by the Detroit Lakes region. Chamber of Commerce. More great events coming up on the DL Community Calendar next. 
And we're back with the Detroit Lakes Community Calendar. And Carrie, you've got a safety conference coming up in just a couple of weeks. And this is going to be a pretty intense uh, three, four hour sit down talking about some pretty important things in the Lakes area. Yeah, this is a great community conversation we hope to spur. Um, There's been a lot of work here in the community, and we know there's more work to be done. So we're titling this, Is Your Organization Prepared? We're doing a seminar. It's all morning long from 8 a.m. till noon at M State. We've partnered with them for their facility and also just uh, their great resources. But we're also bringing in a speaker. His name is Eric Roski. He uh, actually works for the Minnesota State Capitol for their security team. He also has a private company. He does security training around the state of Minnesota. And he's going to focus on, is our organization ready and prepared for something to happen? Could be something small. Maybe you have an agitated customer in your front lobby. Uh, Maybe you have a medical emergency, whether that's your staff or your clients. But maybe there's something happening in the community. Is there an active shooter? Is there a gas leak? Is there a train derailment? Um, Is there a snowstorm that shuts us down for two, three days? What does that look like and how organized and ready and prepared is your organization? I think we've been prepared because we've had to be prepared for the snowstorm thing. <laughs> um, the active shooter and some of the other things, I don't think that, that, that my organization ever even thought of that. Yeah, and there's some simple steps and things that we can do. And think of not only your business, but where do you volunteer? Where do you spend your time? Are you in a church that could really use some of this training? Um, So we can all be wearing multiple hats in attendance. So I really encourage people to send somebody from every organization you're involved with, whether that's work or volunteerism, and really start to get that that thought process going. We're also doing, after Eric speaks, we're going to have the Sheriff's Department, emergency managers, other people in our community here, because we have a lot of great resources. We have things like the code red alert system. Well, how do we use that effectively in our community? So we want to make sure we're not only telling this, the tale of how prepared are we, but are we using our community resources we do have. So it's a great event for certainly um, probably an HR department to send someone from, from your organization in the HR department to this event. Is it also open to the public, just for the general public to, to visit? Yes, uh, there is a cost to attend. It is going to be uh, $45 if your organization is a member of the Chamber of Commerce or $55 for non-members. It is going to be a breakfast meeting. Um, and then it's a full four hours of training and open to anyone. So frontline staff, maybe you're a board member on a nonprofit. This would just be great to get that conversation going and some resources to bring back to your volunteerism. And if you're looking for details on this event or any of the events that, that you have, where would you find that information? Yeah, stop into the Chamber of Commerce. We're at 700 Summit Avenue. Or, uh, of course, check out our website, visitdetroitlakes.com. Or just give us a call. We'll make sure to swing into your business and tell you more. All right. It sounds like a great event in uh, the Lakes area again. We're back with more great events on the DL Community Calendar next. And that'll do it for today's DL Community Calendar. If you'd like your event on the DL Community Calendar, give Abby a call at 847-5624.